Father Stew is based on the incredible true story of the world's most unlikely priest. Please check out the extended preview now. into a regular job that you put into beaten ass, you'd end up being a manager one day. Well, why'd you dress us up as astronauts at piles and shit for Halloween if you didn't want us to shoot for the moon? That's when I had two of you to bet on. Where's this clown? Hey, tell her it's nothing. Not quite. You have a serious infection of the bone in your jaw as well as extremely high inflammation markers in your blood. Oh, well, that's cool. The same thing as the last time your colleague gave me antibiotics, did the trick, right? After your last three fights, you've developed fevers and infections. That's not a normal response to injury. What does that mean? Medically speaking, we need further testing to determine the source of the problem. But metaphorically, it seems like your body's telling you not to fight. Out of that? <laughs> oh, God. Look, of course, the decision is yours. But I must make you aware that the complications could be life-threatening. You set this up, didn't you? Uh, she tell you to say that? Could you give us a minute alone? We got the Keystone cops here. You ain't gonna listen to this loser. I'm trying to run up the bill on you, mama. Damn you for being so careless with your life. Careless? I'm fighting for it. And yours too, I've been putting food on the table. Your deadbeat husband don't. You know, grief ain't a disability, mama. I looked it up. What you think? You're gonna get to be a pro? Honey, you're the age most guys are when they pack it in, and you're still scrapping for a sponsor. You look me in the eyes and tell me that some plastic trophy is worth more than your life. You only got yourself to blame. Making the fuss over all them damn participation ribbons. You set a real low bar. What you expect from your son? That this one don't die. I ain't that lucky. I heard them oil rigs went up pay good. I ain't doing no blue collar book. Well, honey, what else is there?
They had Tommy playing in your room. Got a heck of a hiding for it. Sometimes I thought I hated you for being so good. Making me look bad. Dad probably wonders why you gotta keep a piece like me. I never miss. Oh! Officers. Everything all right here? Yeah, just paying my respects. You Bill's son? Wow. Well, all these years gone, he's still making me look bad, huh? Tip off the old block, huh? Challenge the officer's judgment. It was a stimulating exchange. You know what? I made him a better cop. Get in the car. Hey, they told you why? You pat me on the back. Ain't that the story of your life, being out of context? Oh, I got some good news for you. I figured it out. Yeah, seventh time's a charm. No, I mean, I figured out what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna be an actor. Oh, God. Think about it. Nothing ever made more sense. I mean, I was born to perform. It just took some time to find my stage. Yeah? Where's that at? Hollywood. You ain't been west of Missoula. Oh, you got a map. I'm gonna make it there. <sighs> Baby, you don't belong with those L.A. folks. They're a bunch of carpetbaggers, communists, fascist hippies. I, I ain't trying to belong, Mama. I'm trying to stand out. All right, wait till you see me saving the world, shooting the bad guys, kissing them girls in Pearl, probably all three at once. Isn't it a little late to, you know, try that? Well, they're gonna say late, and they're gonna say great, and I ain't even gonna be dead yet. Mm. Well? You gonna look your father up? Am I gonna look my father up? Yeah. Bill. Come on. Let's go. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 